It's gonna be hit, hit, deflect it, and then come right across the face that way. This hand comes straight up to the chin and then straight down to the forehead. Here, pow, clip, pop, really quick, really hard. Hey, it's Jake Mace with Phoenix Longevity Arts, and here's five knockout strikes for you from Kung Fu. Number one is gonna be when you're both in your fighting position, and no matter how they punch you, if it's a haymaker style punch, right cross or straight punch, I'm gonna to try to get to the inside track of that punch when I'm in here, and he comes in, trying to keep my hands up, and even if he catches me a little bit, my hands are in front to deflect the majority of the power. This hand is gonna come in and try to hit to the arm, of his striking hand. So coming in and then straight up to the jaw. So there's two points I wanna hit. One is on the upper forearm, okay? It's right in here. It's the large intestine 10. And I wanna strike that. And then I wanna to hit to the stomach six, maybe even the small intestine 17. Hit right up in here, kind of where beneath the earlobe, right where that corner of the jaw is. So if you're watching right now, touch yourself right here, underneath the corner of your jaw and get underneath there. You might, at your own risk, you might even try a little bit of a pop right there. It'll kind of move your jaw. That's where you want to strike somebody for knockout. So again, from here, he comes in. I'm going to be hitting the arm point, coming right up into that chin point. Let's go where you guys can see right here. Let's do it slow first. When he comes in, I'm going to be turning the inside. Keep my hands up, though. Hit anywhere on the upper forearm, and then come right inside and hit that point. Try to aim for the stomach six, ST6, right in there, okay? Full speed from here, it's gonna be hit, hit. Okay, when you're playing with your partner, you can use open hands, and they won't get knocked out, they'll just get angry, okay? And when you're doing it for real, you wanna use two different hand positions. One's gonna be a fist, or two's gonna be like a mantis reverse beak. Use the back of your wrist, and we're going to be hitting with the back of the wrist. There's tremendous power in the back of the wrist, so. Three options. When you're playing with your partner, we're gonna be using open hands. Number two is gonna be using fists. And number three is gonna be using mantis beak. And then we would do mantis beak push-ups on the back of your wrists to build that power for your knockout strike number one.